People fighting online, losing their minds. So we read the crazy crap they write and have a fun time. Well, get ready for this week's digital drama. Oh, I got some good old fights going on on social media this week. Thanks for the screenshots and sending them to us at mail at kvjshow.com. Got one here with Gunther who's all pissed because somebody in his unit is playing the French horn late at night. It's driving Gunther insane. Other tenants are hearing it too, and it's causing a lot of problems here, and we're going to act it all out for you. Jaybird is going to play the role of Gunther. I'm going to play Mary. Virginia will be Millie, and we will have Denny's be Vic. Got it. All right, here comes Gunther. Whoever keeps playing the French horn all night better stop or World War Three <laughs> is about to be unleashed on their ass. I haven't slept in three nights because of it. You need to shut the F up. I hear it all the time, and it's keeping me up as well. They aren't even good at horn playing. It sounds like it's coming from one of the upstairs units. I think they're hammered or on drugs or something. <laughs> They keep playing a terrible version of Taylor Swift's Shake It Off. I know, it's awful. I hate the sound of a French horn, especially one that's out of tune. I can't figure out where it's coming from, and it's driving me insane. <laughs> uh, that is my son who's playing the French horn. He has a disease that forces him to stay home from school, and the French horn helps him deal with it. <sighs> We'll try to keep it down. But really, he needs it as a form of his therapy. Uh, you'll try to keep it down? Oh, hell no, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> there is no try. You and your horn-playing son need to keep it down, or your kid is going to end up with a French horn stuck up his cheeks. Oh. Y'all are messing around with everyone's sleep, and then you don't even apologize? Screw you, and screw your son's French horn. <laughs> How dare you speak about my kid like that? I said we would try and keep it down. I cannot believe my son's French horn is causing this much drama. Is it because we are French? Huh, you're discriminating. I know how you Americans are towards French people. It's disgusting. <laughs> oh, being French is not why I don't like you. I don't like you because you're an entitled and selfish a-hole. <laughs> Stop playing the damn horn! P.S. I didn't even know you were French. Is Millie <laughs> even a French name? <laughs> here comes Vic. I'm not trying to start any problems here, but I love the French horn. It's a beautiful instrument, and I haven't heard any issues, and I live in the same unit as y'all. Oh, shut up, Vic. Nobody <laughs> asked you. <laughs> this is not the time for music appreciation. People's lives are being destroyed by a French horn, and it's not effing right. <laughs> Either the horn stops or someone is going to get their ass licked. What? <laughs> hmm. Minutes later, Mary comes back. Um, I'm sorry. I meant to write that their ass is kicked, not licked. I was angry typing. You got to check your typos. <laughs> oh, <my laughs> gosh. You got when you're angry. Big difference. That's a big difference. Is that right? <laughs> the post took a weird turn there. I got another one here where Sarah, she's upset because her HOA won't let her hang Halloween decorations. And some people actually agree with the HOA. And, of course, this is going to start a fight here as well. I'll play the role of Lewis. We're going to have Virginia playing the role of Brady. Bird's going to be Norman Denny's. You can start us off as the role of Sarah, oh. who is upset Ooh. at the HOA. Look at you. Yes. You're the star, baby. Right. Well, I'm going to comb my hair for this one. <laughs> <laughs> it's Radio Denny. Yes. KB, it's for you guys. KBJ TV. Yeah, it's for you guys. <laughs> All right, here comes Sarah. Why can't we put up Halloween decorations? This is so unfair. Like, why do we pay all these HOA fees just so they could tell us no on anything we want to do with our own house? I mean, who doesn't like Halloween decorations? I'll tell you who doesn't like Halloween decorations. <laughs> it's me. They are trashy looking and promote evil. If you want to turn your place into a madhouse, may I suggest you buy a place without an HOA? Pretty simple concept. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's no need to act like a douche about it, Norm. Say I was just asking a question. I bet you're a real fun guy to be around. There's nothing wrong with Halloween decorations. Stop being the Ebenezer Scrooge of Halloween. What, what kind of jerk hates Halloween decorations and then goes on a public forum to trash Halloween lovers? Norm sounds like he needs to get laid because nobody should be that miserable. Getting laid has nothing to do with my opinion. Not everyone celebrates Halloween. Typical woman thinks everyone loves what she loves and then pounce about it when she doesn't get her way. Give me a break. 
Halloween is a trashy holiday, and I shouldn't be forced to celebrate it. Uh, I love Halloween, for the record. It's the only time everyone dresses like a slut. I love it. <laughs> yeah. 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 Last year, I saw some grade A TNA. Yeah. <laughs> and this year, oh, I can't wait. This good old boy can't wait for that Halloween. <laughs> Sarah, I'd still put up what you want to put up. Don't let Norm or the HOA kill your Halloween spirit, girl. Norm sounds like there's an egging in his future coming up. Hashtag Norm's a bitch. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shut up, Norm. I have <laughs> screenshot everything on this thread. Not only will the HOA be getting a copy, but also the Jupiter Police Department. I have no problem destroying your precious Halloween season. Take down your stupid decorations. Not everyone loves to celebrate Satan's special day. Oh. <laughs> Oh, very nice. Thank you very much for sending in those threads. Uh, we got a lot. There's a lot of people complaining about uh, decorations. Uh, there's one. Maybe we can get this ready for next week. It's not about that, a nine uh, and a half foot werewolf, is it? No. <laughs> it's not. It's about this fence. If you're watching KBJ TV, you see those homes, and there's a fence that is uh, there. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, you see that. It's clearly, I would think most people would understand that's a Halloween decoration. And they're mad about that. Somebody posted, they said, I actually got a call from the HOA today about our fence in the front needing to be repaired. Oh, oh my God. It's amazing. The Ooh. HOA thinks that that is a legitimate fence that needs to be repaired. Are you kidding me? Not kidding you. It's meant to look like a spooky graveyard, <laughs> a creepy scene. And let me guess, those are fake skeletons too, Kevin? Oh my gosh. The HOA is yeah. so dumb. You gotta, get, you gotta fix your fence and take care of the dead people in your front yeah i am fixing nothing yeah. <laughs> dummies it That's is amazing. really unreal what we're getting <laughs> post-wise so thank you for that we'll try to get that uh, on here next week for some digital drama